Hey Troopa Loopas, <clears throat> welcome, 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 it's July 1st, it's July 1st, it's July 1st, let's see what the universe has to say about what you guys got yourselves into right now, let's see what the universe has to say for July 1st, and give or take a day or two. We got retreat. I'm feeling more sit back and relax. Okay. You also pulled reconciliation. So somebody from your past might be returning. Any messages from the angel deck? Any messages? I'm just going to pull some random cards and then I'll clarify. Angel therapy. Give your cares and worries to the angels and allow them to take your burdens. I will tell you regarding that, okay, um, <clears throat> that's one of those situations where you need to ask. Like, hey, I got a lot going on. Like, whomever you're talking to, like, um, I give you permission. You know, I give you permission to take my cares, my worries. Okay. Um, help me with this burden. Help me with whatever's going on. That's like, you need to ask, give them permission to step in. Okay. Bring me a higher level. And I'm going to clarify reconciliation with this deck. What would you like us to know about reconciliation? So somebody could be coming back into your life. I don't know if it's a good thing or a bad thing. So let's see what they have to say. Do, 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 do. Do, do. That's like way too many. Reconciliation, please. I did see there's something better. You got yes, you are ready, an opportunity, okay. So there's definitely, you know, spirits like good timing, opportunity, take it if you want it. It's up to you. Let's find out what the treat is all about. So if you, if you're ready, come and get it. Na, na, na. That song just came to me. Na, 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 na. If you're ready, come and get it. I don't know the rest of it though. Okay. Um, any advice for this retreat? <clears throat> Meditate, take a day to yourself, pamper yourself, take care of yourself. It's usually you and someone else. Okay. So, or maybe it's just time for you to hang out with your friends. Disconnect. Okay. Let's see. Let's use this deck. Any other messages? Last verse. Next, give it to a day. Uh, give it take a day or two. Okay. Normally, with this deck, to what well, with these two, with the depiction of the two, to me is, you know, hanging out with your friends or a lover or family, whatever makes you happy. Like if you need to go to the woods, go to the woods. You know what I mean. You need to go to the water, go to the water. If you need to be in public, go to public. Like whatever. Whatever works for you, but make sure you're spending time with someone, okay? And when it comes to somebody returning from your past, you know, you're ready. It is an opportunity, so it's it's really on you. But this also tells me with angel therapy, there's a lot going on. And it's like the tenor wants a lot of weight, right? So go ahead and ask the angels to step in, or your guides, whoever you pray to. So it's... It's positive. It's positive energy. So you got acts. A breakup or a separation. Stop the pattern. Silent treatment or abandonment. So something's going on under the covers. Something's going on. It 
could be what somebody is holding up to. Maybe there's already a, separation, a separation. Maybe there's already been a breakup. You know what I mean? But like stop the pattern because you got something right in front of you. Heartbroken, deeply hurt, sad, separation, breakup, feeling lost, grieving, mourning. Okay, so there's, that's a given, okay, um, that there is heartbreak somewhere. Um, and I, I kind of, I didn't feel the heartbreak, but the first card that came out with a whole bunch of flips says there's something better. So, you know... Maybe I should have took that card. Maybe there is a new opportunity. Yeah, you are ready to move forward and have a new opportunity. Go hang out with who you want to hang out with and go reconnect with who you want to reconnect with. You know, because this is a lot of weight. <clears throat> so there's definitely some pain here. But you got to realize there's new here too. So for some of you, what if somebody does want to come back? Somebody you separated with or someone you broke up with or... Or vice versa. Um, to me, I feel like it's definitely over with, with these two. Okay? But it doesn't mean that somebody wouldn't come back and actually try. It doesn't mean it's right or you should, you know, take care of, take care of you. Maybe you are ready. Maybe there is something better. There is a new opportunity out there. So there's definitely been an ending, but I love how the new energy came out first, right? So that's positive. So now what I want to do is put these back in and I want to clarify reconciliation, looking at it in a positive way, what may be the right person. Maybe there is a third party and it's time for you to, you know, spend more time with the new opportunity, whatever you see. Reconciliation, please. You got kisses, unconditionally loving, giving and receiving affection and falling in love. Okay. So endings for new beginnings. So to me, the reconciliation, so there's probably a third party, but, or too many people in your energy and it's just like sit back, chill out and relax. But somebody might try to come back around too for some of you, where there's already been a breakup, there's already been a separation, there's already been heartbreak, there's already been mourning, there's already been all those things. It's time to put the weight down. There's a new opportunity. You are ready. Okay, so I hope that helps some of you guys that needed, that definitely needed um, this message. You just blinked out on me. Okay, so like I said, I mean, I really hope that um, that helps. I'm going to pull a lesson card real quick. What's going on? Just so you're aware what you might be sitting in or shouldn't be sitting in. You got judgment. I understand that everyone has their own unique paths and challenges. So it is a little bit of a challenge. At the bottom of the deck, you got freedom. All right. You got the power to create your own happiness. That's important to know. So someone, you might have fear of judgment. Someone judging you, you judging them you know, taking, basically by taking a new opportunity or stepping in a certain direction, there's a good chance you can get judged for it. But you know what? You create your own happiness. And you, you do have something here, already here, or something that's coming in that's better than what you were going through. Um, so I'm just going to give you one of these messages. I love this deck. So, 
really consider if something new comes in or it's already in the in the back in the factor, whatever's going on with you. <clears throat> this is not really the opportunity to go backwards. <clears throat> yeah, messages for July first. Messages for July first. All right, you needn't worry. There's no one in your life that hasn't always already loved you. They're all just learning how to show it. Okay, so this person that's coming in or, or vice versa is going to start showing it a little bit more on display. Not like, oh, here's my trophy. You know, but you know what I mean. Like, there's no need to worry. All right. There's no one in your life who hasn't always loved you. They're just learning how to show it. So... You got this newness with something that's been going on within the last three weeks, three months, top, something like that. New opportunity. Take it. Okay. It looks great. At the bottom of the deck, convince yourself, not others. <clears throat> the need to clarify, explain, or justify oneself in a personal relationship or, or self serving. What's important is knowing the truth about how you feel and what you need. Because often points to insecurities that can be dealt with in more effective ways. Okay, so don't, that's that whole judgment. Don't, don't do that. Where's your happiness lie? And it was easier said than done. But it's God on his truth. Spirit on his truth, however. You know what I mean? It's you at the end of the day. Okay? Alright, I love you. Bye, guys.